hi everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to do the last sign out of this series which is 1 to 15th of april for gemini so before starting do subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram for more updates you can also check out playlists for march and april if you're interested in re uh, watching other signs for personal readings contact me on instagram or whatsapp me details are given below sun moon rising and Venus signs in gemini this is going to be a general reading take whatever resonates Leave what does in Gemini for gems? What's happening? Gemini, there's a person, maybe an Aries person, very mature, independent, on a very high page. This person has, has, has some nurturing emotions for you, Gemini. Someone older has nurturing emotions, and I feel like they're taking it slow when coming towards you, okay? They may be sending you some messages signals that they're interested i feel that this person is from a different place like they have a different uh, caste or religion like that and they may have connected through with you for work related purposes so i feel like this person sees you as a uh, childlike and your innocence and your intelligence at the same time makes this person think about you and they feel like helping you they feel like giving you that nurturing feeling that care that attention this is a powerful personality they have a strong base in their career i feel they want to help you in uh, your career as well okay with the money thing also guide you also so this could be your mentor your guide someone senior who is seeing you in a very good light this person cares a lot about you Things about you, but is not opening up to you that much. Okay, they're slow to open up. Also, feel this person maybe started seeing future with you. I feel like this person sees you as a potential life partner. They see you as someone who has that kind of uh, personality that can really make their life, uh, that can really rock their life. Some of you, this person has recently had a divorce or a very bad breakup, and they're trying to come out of that energy i feel it could be you as well gemini that you feel hurt you feel broken by someone from the past and this person is bringing a lot of happiness and excitement in your life and it's gonna be a slow and gradual process i feel right now you may be ignoring this person you may be um not giving them much heed this person is trying to reach out to you but they're taking it slow they don't want to suffocate you or overwhelm you and I feel like Gemini, you may be looking at other options or you may be waiting for the past person to reconnect. But you do not realize that there's someone in the background who wants your attention, who's a much, much better match and who's there to help you, to heal you, who cares for you and who has a good, you know, uh, place, well-established person. You're not aware of this person, maybe. You're not um, catching on the signs that they're sending you. Very subtle subtle signs they may be sending you so you're not aware i feel like you're very much in your mind there has been a recent breakup for most of you gemini's i feel this could be a scorpio that you have uh, broken up from or disconnected from and i feel you're very stressed out you don't want to focus on um uh, new love or stuff like that you're simply into yourself you simply started to uh, work on your career your money okay it has been a hard time for you to handle a self-obsessed um, stuck up guy or a girl you know and I feel like you've started to ignore the past person and move forward however you still miss them you still feel that they, sh they should change you know even though you know that someone who has a nature like that cannot change but you still miss that one day this person would come and talk to you. But then you uh, keeping it strong and uh, you are not going to swivel from your thoughts. You've decided that it's over. You blocked that person physically or mentally. But you've started to move on. And I feel like you're completely ignoring the past person. Also see that you were dealing with a player. Okay, and I also see the past person will try to take a leap of faith towards you, thinking that this time they will convince you again with their words, but no, this time you're not ready to take anyone's shit, and you're moving on, even though it's been a very hard uh, cycle for you, okay? I feel like you're working on your skills, improving your skill, working on your money, okay, improvising 
your talents and your work your business whatever you're doing is uh, what you're worshiping right now you may be, you may be taking risk at work big risk that's going to pay you off well wow someone wants a lifetime with you someone wants a marriage with you okay this is the person that i was talking about could be an aries person someone very mature okay maybe older if not older than very wise in thought process okay this person is going to help you with so many things they're going to guide you about such things which you've never thought or read about you know that kind of person the person with a lot of experience this is a person who's continuously watching your pictures and continuously thinking about reaching out to you. They don't know how, but they're definitely going to take a leap of faith towards you. Okay, and right now you may be juggling to, uh, you know, move on from someone from the past that has been a very self-obsessed person. So yeah, so this new person is going to make an offer towards you. They know that you're the one that they want to be with for their whole life. They see abundance with you. They see partnership in business, partnership at work with you, growth with you. I see most of you, if you don't have any kind of such a person reaching out to you, I do see marriage options, opportunities opening up, a lot of money coming in. Uh, the kind of work that you do i feel like money is gonna be tenfold or happiness this is also going to bring a lot of happiness as well you just keep working on your skill growing it and the more you work on it the more you grow with it okay but i do see that there is someone who wants to marry you okay this person may be showing you subtle signs by flirting with you and you may be trying to control your emotions. You don't want to open up in love with this person because your self-respect is important and you don't want yourself to get hurt again. You may not be trusting this new person because you've been hurt by someone recently. Maybe you were dealing with a player and now you just don't want to give it again and you just want to focus on your work. However, there's someone who really wants you to open up because this person is coming with a lot of positivity and the message for you by the angels is also the same that you need to be positive about future love okay it doesn't mean that if you've had a bad experience it's gonna be like that forever things change people change new people come okay these are just experiences and take it and leave it that's it indecision you're a little bit confused about something gemini what is this confusion about huh third chakra Okay, so I feel like, uh, mm, let me know more from the tarot cards. Like, what does this confusion tell me about your, you, uh, Gemini? What is this confusion about? Okay. All right, you missed the past person. I feel like the past person, if they are reaching out to you or not reaching out to you, doesn't matter. I feel like you feel guilty. You feel like maybe you did something... Uh, you you were mean to your person you said some words which were which you shouldn't have said you know these kind of things are coming into your mind you feeling like should i talk to the past person maybe they miss me of course they miss you but then your self-respect is very important i feel like if you have some sort of confusions about the past person the lover then you really need to move on okay from that person because they always kept you stuck and not uh, very smooth in life very free in life so you really need to maybe you feel like you hurt this person okay maybe a scorpio pisces or a cancer you hurt them and uh, somehow you rejected this person or you were not listening to them uh, to what they had to say but every time they do they do this and you melt you get melted again you are going in that zone don't do that okay you have to let go of the person from the past so that you can reap more much uh more what karma has to give you so stop thinking about the past okay just move on and i feel like your self-confidence will get affected somehow you have some sort of uh, obsession over this past person somehow your confidence is linked with that person but no even if it's that so you have to simply let go of them and just give it give yourself certain time some time and keep working on your career and i feel you rising high i feel your confidence level is going to be high but sometimes you get anxious i feel like anxiety is there yes that's the right word you may feel anxiety at uh, times it's only because of the confusion so whatever confuses you write down in the book write down in your diary and see the pros and cons 
and then come to the conclusion what is the best option what is the right uh, path you should choose if you should go to that person or if you should move on if i go to them what will happen what are the pros and cons if i move on what will the pros and cons and then work on it do not let the confusion ruin the best of you or take the best of you i feel like your confidence is going to grow the more clear you are about your about your decisions about your thoughts the more confidence you're gonna read this is the biggest message for april have faith see there is some distrust about the kind of work you do there's some confusion about the kind of work you do you have um, a little bit of uh, doubt on yourself on your confidence and uh, this is gonna ruin everything so stop over analyzing things and just go with the flow and i feel you're going great you just have to trust yourself you just have to trust what god has uh, led you to and you have to trust the process and leave any everything on god yes that's about it gemini i hope you've enjoyed the reading do not forget to like subscribe share comment and hit the bell bye